today, me, Callie, and Emily are going to make a collab today, and um, she's making a conditioning video, and, and I'm going to be making a stretching video. And if you want to watch my video, the link will be in the description, or you can just search or it'll her probably up. be right here, and you can't click on it, but it will be right here. Maybe and it's um, Emily Dow. So. Yeah, so go check her out. Go su subscribe to her. It's E M I L Y D O Y. D O Y. That's her channel. So let's just get started with some stuff. There's going to be noise in the background because that will be Emily recording her collab video while I'm recording mine. And we're going to be recording at the same time. We're just going to um, stretch out our ankles. So this is pretty easy. You can go on a pike and just roll your ankles, or go on a pike and take one of your legs and put them up here on top of your other leg and like force your ankle to roll kind of and that stretches it even more like that and that's pretty much it for ankles. For this category we're going to be stretching out our legs and I have a lot of stretches for our legs. So first thing is first we're going to do some simple lunges and so with um, your back leg in like a 40 degree angle um, or let's start lunging forward as our knees in a 40 degree angle and then just like kind of reach back a little this is also stretching out our backs and then lunge back and reach down and then go as far as possible into your splits and then you can reach forward reaching backward is good for stretching out your back too and then reach kind of to the side like this and that will help with scales and then also the other stretch that I showed you up against a couch like that. That's a good back sh or uh, back and the leg stretch. And um, you can go into your middle splits like this. And reach forwards to the sides. It's pretty simple stuff. And then you could go stand up and kind of push down into your splits and not just a straddle. And then you could go in a pike position and bend all the way down. And then there are so many stretches that I could take hours to show you guys, but those are a few. We're going to be doing wrists, I mean shoulders. And so what I showed you before, this is good for backs and shoulders. And then just some simple stuff is like, take your arm like this. And if you go, instead of just here, if you go out towards your wrist, it'll pull it farther. And then swing that, or you can go swing it like this. And then you could go behind like this and try to touch um, down your back and your spine. And then you could hold your hands like this. And, or you could like this. This is also good for like, this is also kind of a good um, conditioning video. Or this is like a good conditioning stretch. Or like you could roll your um, shoulders. And I'm trying to think, oh yeah. And also like this, go here and kind of like, you're not really supposed to be bouncing into stretches, but for that specific stretch, it's okay. Um, now I'm going to be showing some wrist stretches. So these are pretty easy. You could just um, put your hands together and like roll your wrist like that. Or you can go like this with your wrist on the floor, go backwards or something like pancakes are called here. Yeah, like, like this. Feel like, the, like that. Yeah, yeah I'm filming. Oh, whatever. It's the same thing. <laughs> Hello. Four words. Special entrance. Emily. <laughs> We're going to be stretching out our back. So first, we can just go up in a bridge and put your legs straight and lean towards your hands. And then next, lay down on your stomach and push up in a pike position with your hips on the floor and lean back. Or you could go in a pike with your hands, reach back and stretch. And then one last stretch. We're gonna be using like a coucher or something and just put one of your legs up and then like reach back into it. And the same thing with the other side. 
And so that's it for back stretches. Um, now I'm just going to be showing you guys some extra things that I forgot to add. So this one in specific is for leg. So you can take um, one of your legs and just reach them back as you're laying on your back and hold it and pull it as far as you'd like. Just like that. Or Emily is going to help me show you guys. These are just some extras and this is specifically for legs and you're just going to take like pretty much just any one of your legs and um, probably you should do both just so they're even and just pull it up as far as you like and as far as you would want to do. And you can Should probably do it to both legs so they are even. And then Emily will have to help me demonstrate another leg stretch. Um, the next few stretches are to lay up or uh, sit up against a wall. And Emily's going to dem help me demonstrate on the music camera. And you can see your faces. Okay, who cares? And just pull up your leg like that. Or you can pull it even to like the side. Here, I'm going to face the side and pull it pull it to the side or you can pull it behind you and pull it up and these are all good stretches for scales, heel stretches, and scorpion slash needles. Um, so we yeah. hope you enjoyed this video and don't forget to go check out Emily's subscribe. Um, yeah, subscribe to her and also um, go check out her other half of the this collab videos. Yes. That will try to link in the description. And box. then this, my name will be right here. My YouTube name, which is Emily Dow. So pretty easy. <laughs> so yeah. bye, guys. Don't forget to do those three things. So comment down below what you are most flexible. Sorry, most flexible on. And then um, like this video with a big thumbs up and go subscribe to both of us. Bye.